Hello everybody, it's me Ian here, and welcome back to another Ruby Chibi reaction video. This time episode one of season two. Hello people of the internet, the farm contains video content that this human behind me does not own personally. Content such as music, videos, sound, images, and all that jazz. So please, give my human a break and um, let him enjoy what he does. Seriously. Ready? When it's on user, this will get loud. Josh, ma. Not done. <laughs> Bro. What's up, people of the internet? It's me, Ian, and welcome back to another reaction video. This time... Hello, people of the internet. It's me, Ian, and welcome back to another Ruby Chitty reaction video. This time, episode one of season two. This time, Director Austin. We're here on with finally with season two of Ruby Chibi. I wrapped up season one already yes last week, last Ruby Friday with with um Alright, let the Kawinas return in three, two, one. Let the Kawinas begin for the first time. In three, two, one, go. Really, <laughs> Chibi? Huh? <laughs> what? <laughs> okay, what happened to the Ruby Chibi? And what happened to the Ruby Chibi title? Did some is someone messing with it? Professional. Wayne Edfield, you're you're in three, me. two, one. Cut. Cut. Ah! Chibi Aspen! We only got that one glimpse of him in that little red riding hood skit from season one. And again, stupid, stupid, stupid! Why did I recognize his voice in that one? I'm a bad Ruby fan. Even though I haven't seen a lot of Ruby, don't blame me. I've only seen a little bit of Ruby. Ladies, ladies, we have a show to do. What is the problem? <laughs> the problem is Blake sitting on my head. <laughs> it wouldn't be if Yang hadn't knocked everything Let over. Let me see that again. Let me see what happened. <laughs> Jimmy! <laughs> Everyone landed. Okay. White landed on Ruby's skirt when Blake landed on when Blake landed on Yang's head. <laughs> it didn't happen. The problem is Blake sitting on, on my, my head. head. <coughs> well, I wouldn't, wouldn't be if Yang, Yang had knocked, knocked everything, everything over. <laughs> All right, everyone, Once calm down. down. Accidents happen. But what if it wasn't an accident? What if we're being sabotaged? Hmm. You mean some sort of nefarious plot being perpetrated by someone within our very own ranks? <laughs> Ouchie! Sorry about that. Mercury! Someone who pretends to be a friend. Okay, now where's he's Emerald? Trying to destroy everything we've worked so hard. Wait, to build. where's Emerald? <laughs> there she is. Oops. Ah, there's Emerald. Hmm. Yes, all of that, all of those things you just said. <laughs> Ruby, I'd have to be a pretty incompetent leader if I didn't notice something like that happening right under my nose, don't you think? But... Now run along, all of you. Why don't you go play in a forest full of deadly grim? Yeah, that would tear you limb uh, from limb. Okay. <sighs> <laughs> Such sweet girls, but so naive. Yeah, you are... <laughs> <laughs> there you are, Cinder! Hey, long time! This giant rose seems to fall on me completely by accident. Honestly, sometimes, sometimes I, think I think it's too easy. Oh, compost game! Remember this? Season one? I remember this. Board game. That board game is skit they did. Achoo! Oh! Sorry. Ah! It's so great to see Pierre again, even though the only time I get to see her is in Ruby Chitty. Now the only thing I want now, um, now I wanted to say, now I want the same thing Freelancer Amber wanted. I also want Chibi Velvet. 
I also want, um, I want Chibi Crow, I want Chibi Tai Yang, I want Chibi, um, I want to see what, and I also want to see what, um, let me think, let me think who I want. Well, I got my wish for Chibi's Y, so that's a check. Chibi Sun and Neptune, check and check. Chibi Team Juniper, check. So the only one I have left to complete my checklist of ones is Chibi Velvet, and the only ones I have left to complete my checklist are Chibi Velvet, Chibi Crow, and Chibi Tai Yang. I'm probably not going to get to all the episodes today. I'm probably just going to do one episode a day on... on Thank you for inviting me to play your game of dodge the ball, then eliminate your enemies with the ball, Ruby. We just call it dodgeball, Penny. Also, we're all friends here. Not, not enemies. enemies. Of course. I will adjust my targeting parameters. What? Yeah, my junior detective senses are telling me something's off about her. Huh, very what? off. No, there isn't. She's completely normal. Isn't that right, Penny? That is correct. I am a normal meat person, just like you. <laughs> No one knows she's a robot. Oh, and that's me. Hurry up and pick so we can kick your butt, Sean. Psst, don't pick her. Yeah, uh, go for the dog. You guys, I'm not picking the dog over her. We choose Penny. <gasps> I, that is correct. I am a normal meat person, just like you. Now, um, as for DBX, I will continue doing DBX. Oh, okay. I will continue on uh, DBX hurry up and today. Pick so we can kick your butt, Sean. Psst. Don't pick her. Yeah, uh, go for the dog. You guys, I'm not picking the dog over her. Take off we the mustache, <gasps> Neptune, please. You are I afraid of water. Emotionally bonding with one, of her opponent, one of her characters, one of her teammates is afraid of water. Don't listen to him, Penny. And don't feel bad if you can't hit anyone right away. It's very Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Owie. <laughs> you mean that, like that? That was weird. Uh-oh. She's ang she's angry. Uh, yeah. Never That's make her angry. Awesome. Never make her angry. Uh, Never. Uh, oh my! Run! This is embarrassing. Uh, Run! <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Definitely something weird about this girl. Beep. Director Aspen UFO dodgeball. So let me think. Okay, let me think of everything. First bet. Chibi Aspen! Yes! That's one thing that's crossed off on my checklist. Then, then the second, then, ugh, the reason why the intro got messed up was because of, of Emerald and, Emerald and Mercury and Cinder, all three of them. Now, as for that one outburst I had when on Chibi Aspen came on, that was just because I was not a good Ruby person. I'm not a good person for not recognizing Austin. And again, stupid, stupid, stupid! Next, um, next bit. Um, dodgeball. Next bit, um, UFO, I think. That was a reboot. That was a remake of, ch of season one's Compost King thing they did. Back in season one with the board game skit. Ha, huh, that was actually my favorite skit. I love to see Pierre again. Even though she is not with us anymore after volume three. And again, why didn't John help Pierre with Cinder? He could have stepped in the way of the arrow. He could have, he could have saved Pierre. He could have blinded Cinder long enough that Pyrrha could escape. Or if John re realized his aura enhancing semblance, he could have saved Pyrrha's life that day. Again, John, that was your worst moment. So yeah, thank you all so much for watching. And make sure if you like this video, hit that like button. Like a, like a boss. And if you really liked it, go ahead and subscribe. And until next time, be nice to animals. Don't be mean. Keep moving forward. Bye-bye. Dun-dun-dun-dun-dun.